Hello everyone, welcome back to another straight razor shade. Today I'm using Australian Private Reserve uh, Torchwood and I've already loaded up with a uh, dogwood handcrafts handle. Double-ended wood with a 24 millimeter B9A knot from uh, Declaration Grooming. And I'm working with two days of growth today. I'm gonna go back for more soap. Today is another, you know, wedding wedding season. Wedding season is in full gear, I believe, and today is another one that I have to attend but luckily this time it is luckily this time it is as a plus one so not quite the number of photo ops as being in the wedding party so Today's straight razor shade will mark a, what do you call, a slight bump in confidence to use it for a more important event, even though not really that important. As long as I don't have a giant gash in my face, I think I'm good. If it's not the closest shave, I think I'm good. Today's gonna be a nice sunny day. Mid 60s to low 70s. Going with a bit of a woody scent. I do have the matching UDP for this particular scent. So I think it will work just fine. Stop going crazy. And that the previous shave was absolutely amazing. It was really a it was really, really close, comfortable, and it came out of it with very happy with it. So I'm going to try to replicate that. And that previous shave was something I definitely go out for, uh, a result that I use, I'd be satisfied with if I needed to go out for like date night or whatever. Max Sprecher 88 Spanish Point. That inverted pass was the one that uh, did the trick for real. Now it's just a, a matter of ma mastering it. Feel like right there to get that point i would sort of feel like i need a steeper angle in relation to the surface of my skin and it would cause irritation because i can't really see that well when you're going into yourself when the blade is going into yourself Thank you. 
At the previous wedding, I saw a couple old friends and they were like, what you up to? And what's your, what are your weird interests that you pick up over COVID in the past years? Excuse me, there was lather in my nose. And I showed them the Instagram page and like that they saw this razor. It was like, you shave with that. And you know, I said, I try. I'm getting a little bit better at it with every shave. really like the scent, but I don't think I'm gonna go heavy on the sprays later on. You don't wanna... Stand out too much more, I guess. At a wedding. In other news, the Wolfman is coming back. been gone for a couple weeks really allowed me to revisit straight razor shaving more closely and discovering this inverted pass was working it just goes to show really need some more consistent use of straight razor shaving to really hone that technique and get better at it because it's really easy to forget that, that muscle memory, I think. I certainly did. I would forget which strokes to, to hit which areas. But at the same time, you know, the Wolfman is a joy to use. So, tough to resist as well. Oops.
That part is so tough to get. Even I'm going sort of against the ring, against the grain. And also, I feel like I, you know, when I was learning to straight with the shape, I watched a lot of the other guys do it. I learned really well by watching other people do it as well. And unfortunately, a lot of them also did not have, even very seasoned straight razor shavers don't um, shave their chin or mustache area on a regular basis. So I didn't learn that that part was the most challenging and with less guidance than others, other areas for shaving. But I think I'm slowly getting there. Yeah, those guys have no idea, or much less of an idea at least, how hard it is to hit that area. Not just to hit that area, but get close. I hit it, but it's not close. All right, here we go. Again, look at this, sort of like that. The issue is tough to see as well. I can see, okay, maybe it's this way. Like this. Angles. Ooh, ooh. Yep. Not as smooth of, as a motion as I would like. A lot of buffing there. But I think it's too dangerous to go. There's one guy over here. I'm gonna actually try to hit it. Or clean up. Since today is, you know, a wedding day. Normally I wouldn't risk it. Hmm. How about again? That's a lot of hair. Not sure that you can see it, but you see the little black speckles. And it's just nice to see. <laughs> I'm gonna stop there. I think it's presentable. 
I will not stop there because I forgot this patch. Again, this was one of the more successful shaves, in my opinion, shavers shaves. Super close, again, especially in this area. I think hitting this area really did the trick with that inverted pass. Again, just need to do it more. I will definitely try to stick to it. And, and I learned that if I go slow here, this against the grain is really close as well. That was a great shave. Thank you for watching. Um, the next one, I might have a brush coming in. <laughs> uh, a new one. And maybe that will show up. But in the meantime, I'll definitely try to squeeze in more straight razor shaves. Especially discovering this new technique or just being more intent, having more intent with it and it's working out very nice i can't help but just feel very satisfied with walking away with this straight uh these type of straight razor shaves versus before it's always a little patch hair that was not too nice not too presentable still a little bit but i can i can go out with this thank you for watching wolfman will be back new brush and maybe on the way and I'll see you in the next one. Thank you.